community leaders and distinguished guests visited Mountain Home Air Force Base during Honorary Commander Day. The DVs toured the facility and engaged in a biohazard screening demonstration. Not pretty confident that whatever the source is, that it's cesium-137, but if the bomb dropped... As you see, just taking a sample. Mass casualty exercise. They make it realistic as possible. Yeah. They are currently assessing... They go ahead and make sure that they're safe and transport over down there by the decon. And they got to witness how first responders decontaminate hazard um, victims. The fact that they're able to work under the, the conditions they do, the environment they're in, the suits and the gear that they've got to wear, um, it tells me that not only are they good at their job, they're, they're very, very well trained. Honorary Commander Day helps key players in the local community learn how every airman helps develop and deploy combat-ready airmen, take care of gunfighters, washed off by soap and water for the most part, as well as protect and enhance wing resources. I think it opens the eyes to a lot of our honorary commanders who uh, this is their first experience to see what all the medical group does down here at Mountain Home Air Force Base. Then it was their turn. Exercise, exercise, exercise. Civic leaders got a notice that they, like many airmen, had to rapidly deploy. Except this time, it's only a simulation. I know that what we went through today is, is kind of small scale, um, but it tells me how efficient uh, you all do your job to be able to process that many folks um, through the various stages of out processing before they get on the bird and fly off downrange. Uh, it's an interesting process, and I'd like to see the whole thing up close. What happened, you know? Once that patient stabilized, they will again break off. Yeah, right there. Right there, right there. Okay. You have, you have hurt anywhere else? Slight tenderness down here, slight tenderness right here. Trauma. And then they'll fix and get to have a two station here for the entire long night. As the exercise drew down, visitors listened to some lessons learned as one airman spoke on his personal experiences while deployed to a combat zone. There he is. He's the hero. But this is us in a remote valley in Afghanistan called Bala Murghab. You've probably never heard of it. The crack, crack, cracks that seem a little bit distant. This event helped strengthen the bond between Airmen of the 366 Fighter Wing and the people of Mountain Home. Coming out to something like this um, broadens your scope a bit and you understand that there's more to it than just the airplanes that are flying over our head. Reporting for Mountain Home Air Force Base, I'm Tech Sergeant Joe Wolston.